Hi guys! This is Marky again from Afforda Tech. And ngayong araw na ito, I'm going to show you a tutorial regarding sa installation ng UV tempered glass. Now, usually yung mga UV tempered glass, mas applicable gamitin sa mga phones na may curve like this one. Ang advantage ng UV tempered glass is mas makapit siya sa phone. Unlike dun sa mga tempered glass na adhesive lang sa sides ang ginagamit. Tamang-tama guys, if gusto nyo makatipid, kindly watch this video until the end. Dahil pag nagpa-install ka ng tempered glass sa mga malls, it usually costs around 700 to 1,500 pesos. Now, that's pretty much expensive for a tempered glass. Now, itong mga types of tempered glass na ito is similar dun sa mga ini-install sa mall. So, makakatipid ka pa. I usually order them through Shopee and they can go as cheap as 90 pesos to 200 pesos each depende sa quality ng UV tempered glass so napakamura guys disclaimer lang syempre ikaw ang mag install ng tempered glass so the risk of doing it wrong is very high that's why meron tayong video tutorial for this now guys before we start disclaimer again do this at your own risk dahil I usually do these installations since the dawn of time so, it's pretty much normal to me how to install it. So, kung first time mo mag-install, kindly watch carefully. And if you have to rewatch it, uh, please rewatch it. Dahil yung process is involving liquid glue that can really mess your phone if it's not waterproof. Now, first things first, we need the tempered glass. This is a brand named T-Max. So, this is much better than the other tempered glass na around the range ng 90 pesos to 150 pesos. Now, this only costs around 240 to 290 pesos. May kasama na siyang glue together with the glass. So, kung bibili ka ng UV lamp, like this one, it's a separate one. Uh, pwede kang bumili ng separate one or package. Medyo mahal lang ng konti. Now, to use this UV lamp, you need a power bank and a cord micro USB cord or pwede rin yung mga charger na may micro USB to plug it like this so kapag open ang UV light as you can see the violet light it will quickly dry the glue that you place sa screen mismo okay now we're all set lahat ng gagamitin natin nandito na to finish the process of installing so let's start now, the very first thing to do guys is to install an application called Bubble Level. Now, ginagamit ang application na ito to uh, level the surface area or ipantay kung saan mo ilalagay yung phone. Ang pinaka-purpose bakit natin ginagamit ito is para hindi matapon yung glue. Pag nagalagay ka ng glue, at least pantay yung uh, area or even yung scatter ng glue. Now, installed na siya. And let's try to level the area. Madali lang siyang gamitin guys. You need to center that circle, the white circle as you can see, sa mismo cross mark. So pag na-center niyo yung white circle, dito sa cross mark na to, uh, basically it's already leveled or pantay yung surface area. Now as you can see, hindi pa centered yung white dot sa mismong circled cross na naka-indicate sa center. So, I'm going to put some materials para maingat ng konti yung phone and mag-center siya. So, that means pretty much pantay pag nag-center yung white dot dun sa cross mark. And there you go, nakapasok na yung white dun sa circled cross. So basically, it's already centered. And let's start to do this now. Patayin natin yung phone. Try to turn it off. Siyempre, you need to turn it off para walang light or disturbance pagka nilagay mo yung tempered glass. Previously, nag-install ako ng screen protector. So I'll remove it also. So let's clean the screen first by using this wet damp cloth. We need to clean it, remove the dust and other debris na nasa uh, screen. 
Kapag hindi natin nilinis yung screen, may possibility na makapasok yung dust sa mismong glue and papangit yung quality ng pagkaka-install. So, you don't want to have a screen na medyo may mga uh, imperfection when you're looking at the screen. Now, after that wet cloth, we use this dry cloth naman to remove any liquid and to make it squeaky clean. Now, after wiping it with the cloth, we're going to use these stickers para i-plug natin or seal natin yung mga holes sa phone uh, just to be safe. This will prevent any excess glue na makapasok sa mga holes ng phone, especially yung mga speaker grills and yung micro USB port. Now, let's put it on the sides sa speaker grill and then sa micro USB port. Now, the last thing that we need to do before we put on the glue is to remove any excess dust na meron sa screen by using this uh, dust absorber sticker. Very common yung dust guys, lalo na pag mainit yung panahon, maraming dust. Minsan, segundo lang, mapapansin nyo, kakalinis nyo lang ng screen, uh, meron na namang dust na nag-accumulate. Now, here's the glue. Lalagay na natin siya by opening the cap. There you go. And twisting the other one at the end. Para malagay natin yung glue. Be careful guys kasi pagka hindi tama yung pagkakalagay ng glue, magkakaroon ng bubbles yan. And pag nagkaroon ng bubbles guys, papangit yung installation. So, uh, the work around there, pag nagkaroon siya ng bubbles, you remove the tempered glass carefully and uh, get a needle and punch the bubble kung saan siya nag-occur. Either sa mismong glue or sa tempered glass kung nalagyan na ng glue yung upper tempered glass. Now, as you can see, ni scatter natin ng pakonti-konti yung glue uh, to empty the container and also to avoid bubbles. Pag nag-occur uh, kasi ng bubbles yan, as, as I mentioned, uh, you need to prick it using a needle para ma mawala yung bubble kasi papangit talaga yung installation when uh, it occurs. Now, let's put on the tempered glass. Uh, let's remove the sticker below first. You need to put it quickly kasi yun nga, uh, iniiwasan natin magkaroon ng dust again sa screen. Uh, that's why you need to put it carefully. So slowly but surely. There you go. Walang bubble. So as you can see, it's perfect. Now, huwag kayong mag-worry if mag-overflow siya. You just need to prepare a cloth, a dry cloth, just in case na mag-overflow sa either sides or sa top you can use it para i-absorb niya yung excess glue. As you can see, na uh, scatter na yung glue. Kinocover na niya yung buong tempered glass. And it's almost perfect. Yeah, na-cover na niya lahat. Now, if you think na fully covered na or nakita niyo na na fully covered na ng glue yung tempered glass, you can make some adjustments sa mismong tempered glass. Slight adjustment kung hindi fit or hindi sakto yung alignment niya sa screen ng phone now if you think the perfect na which is uh, wala namang perfect masyado lang mataas ang standards mo kaya hanggang ngayon walang nangyayari sa love life mo abay kailangan talagang mag adjust ka but in the end we find ourselves where we started we cannot question love when it has its own reasons now eto na guys the final step in this tutorial which is using the UV light to cure the glue or to bond the tempered glass and the glue sa screen so as you can see uh, upper part first then the middle and then the lower part you can let the UV light stay for about 3 to 5 minutes for each part so sa upper part let's uh, cure it for 3 to 5 minutes and the middle part ng screen Okay, another 3 to 5 minutes. And let's put it on the lower part. Another 3 to 5 minutes. Para siguradong siguradong tuyo. And after the curing, you can now clean the phone. Para kung may excess glue man yan or any stuff na meron sa lower part or sa sides, you can quickly remove it to make it look slick. Now, here it is guys, the finished product. Very smooth, parang walang nakalagay na tempered glass. It's 
pretty slick. Now let's put some alcohol para mawala yung ano niya kung meron ng virus. Now only use alcohol kapag ka meron ng nakapatong sa screen. Hindi siya advisable gamitin kung bare yung phone because over time it will remove the oleophobic coating na nasa glass ng phone. Uh, yung nagpapadulas sa mismo screen when you touch it. Now, syempre nakahawak ka ng glue and other stuff. So, kailangan mo Paghugas ng kamay Paghugas ng kamay If nakatulong ang tutorial na ito guys, please subscribe and hit that bell icon. Thank you for watching guys and have a great day ahead. Bye bye! Maghugas ng kamay Maghugas ng kamay Kalusugan ay ingatan Maghugas ng kamay